So, Anne, right here we are in Istanbul. Uh, instead of being on the high seas on our way to Gaza. So what's happening with the flotilla? Well, like every one of the flotillas we've ever done, we have delays. What are some of the political reasons that there are delays? Well, you can guess what they are, and I think it's called the United States of America. Is it shocking that the U.S. is putting pressure on Turkey to not let these boats go? I mean, every time we've had a flotilla, the U.S. Uh, State Department has issued a travel warning of American citizens. Don't you go on those boats because we don't want you challenging the, the Israeli government. And now when the U.S. is complicit in the genocide of Gaza, our, our presence as U.S. citizens on this uh, is, is challenging that the U.S. government's uh, uh, complicity. So sometimes the U.S. uses carrots, saying we'll give you a, a loan, a, a World Bank, IMF, do something to help your economy. Sometimes it uses sticks. Uh, what do you think is being used right now? Turkish uh, military is a part of NATO. Uh, NATO forces buy a lot of U.S. equipment, and we give loans. We give very uh, good loans, uh, low-interest loans for things. So Certainly the military aspect of this, of the U.S. continuing to supply uh, Turkey with a lot of lot of military aid, certainly has a lot to do with it. Well, and lastly, isn't Pre President Erdogan in a difficult position politically, having uh, his party lost big time in the local elections that just happened recently? Well, that's, that's correct. In these local elections, five of the major cities voted in into their mayor's positions people not from his party, and I think the, the amount of votes that were lost was something like 30 percent, 35 percent. So uh, on the political side of it, he is definitely wanting to um, rebuild uh, the community uh, of the voters. But And that's where, you know, it's interesting that uh, the people of, of Turkey want to help the people of Gaza. And in fact, uh, President Erdogan has made some of the strongest statements for stopping the genocide uh, to, uh, you know, to help the people of Gaza. And one would think on one level, then, okay, let the boats go. That's because that's a symbol on behalf of the people of Turkey. Uh, so that's, that's where we hope the people of Turkey are really putting pressure on the, on the government, just as citizens in our own country are putting pressure on our government. Well, let's hope the countervailing force of people power wins out and the boats are able to sail. Let the flotilla sail. Let us sail. Let, Let us, us sail. sail.